It's gorgeous. Are you the original owner? Um, no. No. Gotcha. I pulled in there to turn around. Like oh, you, that's good. You've had it that long. That's cool. That's neat. Went around the first started did everything to it, and now we just everybody's having fun. Is it like a? Is it like a California car? Or? It was. It was. It, was, it, was, uh, well, it sure LA. looks like it. <laughs> from LA originally. Really. Yep. Spent his entire life out there, and then uh, I did the show up on it, and uh, now it's here in Michigan. Gorgeous. I had a 66 coupe that had a 302 out of a Maverick in it, but uh, nothing, it was in nice shape, but it wasn't show quality like this one. It could have been, though, if I had repainted it. Wow, look at that. It is gorgeous, 351, oh my goodness. Look at that thing. Wow. Well, that's cool. Is, is this thing for sale? <laughs> I didn't think so. I don't blame you. I don't blame you. I wouldn't either. That's funny. So this was, you were saying that this was a, a Michigan car and restored? or That's hard to believe. Boy, what, it couldn't have been driven in the winter. It had its spots. Did it? Yeah. Cool. Yeah, cool. Gorgeous. That looks good in white. Yeah. You know what I'm surprised I don't see down here? Are there any Cobras around here? Even kit no. cars? No. Not, not a one. Oh, you're kidding. No, this, this, my Boss 302, and that blue one right over there, right. that's one, but he don't have a stripe package. He didn't put the stripes on it. They look good. The only two. Great. Larry Shandona, his design on these. Good job. You could put no stripes on this thing and they'd look amazing. Yeah. You know what I mean? Well, that's that's why I think the Moss 429 was the nasty. Oh, it's simple. Oh, I love it's got those. The tags on the side. Oh. Tell you what it is? But it's got a nice big suit. That's my favorite Mustang. It's all needed. Moss 429 and Grabber Blue. This one's nice though too. Very cool. Got some nice exhaust. Oh my goodness, look at this. Is this another Autolite cover? It is, look at that. That's funny. Another Autolite battery cover, I love it. It, it. it fools me every time. I walked up to another car and I go, where'd you get that battery? And they go, oh, it's a cover. It's, got, it, it's fine though, it, it works. Gosh, look at that. That is a rare motor. So has this motor ever been rebuilt? Yeah. Have you? Yeah, I did. Did you do anything extra to it? it not that it needs it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What a, I, I do race engines too. So. What did you do to this one? Uh, I did some port work on it. Port? Valve, valve angles. Really? Yeah, valve angles, right. The seat angles. Yep, yep. Better, better pistons. What kind of pistons did you put on it? TRW. TRWs, yeah. Those are good. As good as anything else, that really. That motor was built in the early 80s, so it, doesn't, it didn't have the luxury of using a better grade of pistons. Hey. The TRWs were a little heavy. Yep. <sighs> this thing's gorgeous, though. Wow. I don't know. I'm not a big fan of black interiors because it's so hot in the summer. Oh. Well, with the white car, yes. That's very neat. But I, I like what you said. The, the Grammar Blue Boss 429 or 302 for the white interior is the best. Uh, it, it, it speaks to me. Yep. You know. Me too. So this car is not for sale. Smart man. I'll be like the guy on County Cars. What number would get your attention? <laughs> you ever seen that guy? <laughs> He's a cool guy, though. He's awesome. He, their shop built some nice stuff. There are a few foot shows on that do nice work. Yeah. I like um, I like Iron Resurrection. I like the work they do. Yeah. Bannon Works does good work. 